Pilawa fans, so back to the video, okay? This is the part two to the how about the time I got scammed and hacked in the same day video. So anyway, as you can uh, as you can read the title, this is the how did I recover my Instagram account in 2021. So y'all, that's gonna be a I'm I'm gonna be bouncing around in this video also, so stay tuned. Let's see. So guys, it's official that, okay, the the hacker, she she's in my account doing God knows whatever, okay? And also, you guys, for you guys to be more aware of it, if if y'all if y'all can do everything within your power to report this account, please do. She got two accounts, okay? I'm gonna put the screenshots up. Cause y'all, y'all, I'm let's stop this from happening to a lot of people, y'all. And y'all even though some part of me feels like a fool for doing this, but y'all, we all got high hopes, okay? We are human. We are allowed to go through trials and errors. We are allowed to make a mistake and learn from them, okay? Even though I am still pissed and salty at this situation right here, y'all, there's nothing wrong with taking chances, okay? But anyway, y'all, this is, this, is, this is her Instagram account, okay, y'all? She got two Instagram accounts, you know what, yeah. Okay, so you guys, this is her Instagram accounts, okay? Now, y'all, we need to stop things like this from happening to, to people, okay, y'all? Because in, it's people like this that makes it hard to trust anybody these days. Let's be real. Especially me. Y'all, that's her Instagram she she's in my account already so y'all let me officially begin how did i recover my account so y'all it's clear that you know what that she's in okay y'all so instagram have this thing where it's called a i'm logged out of my account i'm logged out of my account okay so for me to be as authentic with with y'all i'm gonna log out of my Instagram account, the one I got back just now. I enter my UL username. So, my Instagram username, but then my past. Y'all, get this. The dumbass scammer, she did not change my Instagram username. And that's why it was easier. It was easier for me because let's say if she changed my username, I probably. Like, it's clear that. It's clear. You know what? Damn, now that I look at it, she is kind of stupid a little bit. Because, y'all, she didn't change my phone number that was linked to my Instagram account, and she did not change my username account, my username. The only thing that she changed was the password, and she convinced me to change it to my email address to the bit, the Bitcoin FX thing email. Okay? So, you guys, so good thing that I was, e I was able to, e I was easily able to search my Instagram username, but then the password was not working. She changed the thing and everything. So I clicked on forgot password. And y'all, every time that I clicked on, and this is the email that will, hmm. after I insert my username and I click forgot password, this is the, the screen that will come up and I will click next. Now y'all, these are the two options that I was seeing, but y'all mind you, mind you, my cell phone number was the same. My cell phone number was the same, but the email address wasn't. So you guys, at the time I kept on, damn, hold on. I kept on press, I, oh, I can't talk. Because the email address, I knew I couldn't send the the code to the email because the email was associated with the one that she hacked into what was the um bitcoin thing i kept on sending the code to my phone number and whenever i would send the code to my phone number i did get you know what this is the code that will this is the screen that comes up and when the code comes to my cell phone i would just easily ins insert the code but y'all I'm trying to remember when after the code got sent to me, y'all. 
y'all. It there was this there was this screen that was say that was say into I'm trying to log into my LG dot five name account. Okay, I'll click the blue button. Now 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 y'all. I I'm into my account, but at the time y'all it was not working. I'm trying to remember y'all. Oh yes. Went to the home screen and I entered my UL my username. Then I said I pressed forgot password. The, my only two options were, you know, the email and my phone number. I kept using my phone number to get into my account. As whenever I would after I used my cell phone, my cell I got the I got the code from my cell phone, I easily in inserted it in the box and then y'all there was this process that said that that like you know it was this pause screen that came up I don't remember if I managed to go back and find the screen somewhere I can easily insert it but who knows but y'all but y'all anyway I'm going to wait wait it was Facebook Y'all, I think I remember something, y'all. I got an email from Facebook saying that boy confirmed your identity. Oh, finally. Okay, y'all, my bad. So, y'all, what happened? So, yes. I cannot believe I forgot it. So, y'all, this is the first, this is the step that I took, okay? After, when it was not working, the only options that were available was the I can enter one of my backup codes mind you guys at the time when I first originally set up my Instagram account I did not I did not um remember no backup codes I did not enable no two step factor authorization thing or whatever and whatnot I did not so that was out of the question and then there was this other option called get help yes I, I, don't, I don't know if I can screenshot that but I don't, it's not in my phone so but when when I clicked on the get help option, it brought me to this. It brought me to, man, I cannot believe it. Oh y'all, there's this website, y'all. I'm I'm so sorry, y'all. Y'all, I am so sorry. Y'all, there there's this website that helped me get back into my account. But at the time, I was kind of doing things wrong. It's loading. The website is loading. Y'all, because I don't want to give, I don't want to stir y'all wrong, okay? But because I was at a dead end with the, I didn't know the, the code, the backup codes or the authorization codes or whatever and whatnot, I went back to my username and I pressed forgot password and I re-entered my username. This is the screen that came up next, okay y'all? So I entered my username and then I press need more help. And then I clicked on the request support. And y'all, this is, this is the... Ooh. This is the screen that came up for me, okay? This is the request support. If you're unable to sign into your account, you can submit a support request and we will be in touch. So y'all, here's what I was doing at the time. At the time, I was inserting my username. I mean my bad, my my email address. You know, my lava guy email address into both the email you signed up with and the contact contact email if different and then I clicked on the personal account with photos of me and then I pressed my account was hacked and then I gave a whole description okay so y'all when that would happen I got a text message from Facebook and this is the screenshot right here y'all it reads hi thanks for contacting us before we can help we need you to confirm that you own this account Please reply to this message and attach a photo of yourself holding a handwritten copy of the code below. Mm -hmm. 
please make sure that the photo you send includes the above code handwritten on a clean sheet of paper followed by your full name and username. Clearly show both the code and your face and is a the code in the photo is attached to your reply as a JPEG file. If this account doesn't include any pictures of you or is used to represent someone or something else, we won't be able to help until we receive a photo that meets these requirements. Keep in mind that you can also use backup codes to complete the two-factor authorization process and log into your account. Thanks, the Instagram team. So you guys, I did that and I did all of that, okay? So after that, you guys, I did just that. So I went and y'all, yeah. So you guys, this is this is what I had to do. I wrote the code, my first my my first and last name, and my Instagram username. And then I I downloaded um an image converter an image converter app to make sure that it was in JPEG form. So I did it. I sent it twice just to make sure, okay? And so you, and so y'all when I did it I was not hearing anything from Facebook at the time. Wait. After I send the whole like the code, my first my my first and last name and my you and my Instagram username, Lava fans. So after I have sent them my code, my first my first and last name and my Instagram username, this is the email I got. It says, "Hi, thanks for contacting us. It looks like you're having a trouble with logging in to troubleshoot login issues." Visit the help center. If your account has been hacked or you have lost access to your account, please visit the reporting section of the help center to learn how to file a report. You guys, I have went to the help center. I've been looking, looking and doing this and doing that, dude. I literally, I sent, I sent two codes. I can't, I did, I filled out two reports. Facebook sent me the same email saying, hold um, write the code on a piece of paper, the first, first and last name, and the Instagram username, and um, convert the image to a PG, my bad, a, a JPEG file, and send it to them. This is the email I kept on getting, y'all. So it was not, it was not working. And so, guys, I was literally, I was, I was googling YouTube about how to do it. Also, there was a woman, her YouTube link. She was able to help me out a little bit, but her, the way how she got back into her account, it did not work for me. It was, I had to do something with Facebook, create a whole Facebook brand. I don't know. I'm going to put her YouTube channel link in the description down below if I can find it. But yes, yeah, so you guys, when the Facebook code was not working, I decided to send a video. I had to send a self video of me. I guess I had to take angles of myself, y'all. In all in all honesty, y'all, I do not remember how the heck I was able to get into like a video. I, I, my blur. <laughs> I do not remember how I was able to, you know, to to damn. I do not remember how I was able to send a video to Facebook or my, my bad to Instagram. All I know is that Instagram had an option where I can take a video of myself from all angles and send it to them, okay? And so, I did that. Okay. Okay, guys. So after I 
I filmed my I filmed myself, I filmed a video for Instagram, recorded myself from all angles, you know, and all that stuff. This is the e after I send the video to Instagram, this is what this is the email that they send me. They said, We received your request. Thanks for submitting your selfie video. We received this information and it's pending review. You can expect to hear from us within one business day. Thanks, the Instagram team. And then, on that same day, later on that day, this is what happened. It says, we weren't able to confirm your identity from the video you submitted. You can submit a new video and we will review it again. Y'all, again, I was having trouble about, I wanted to, I wanted to send another video, but in all honesty, I don't know what I pressed at that time to do the video itself, you know? So I was back to square I was back to square one. How the heck can I get back to my account? So you guys, here's the thing that clicked that clicked for me. This is where this website comes in handy. Y'all, this is the website that literally it saved my behind. Literally. And it walked me through the whole step-by-step -step process, you know? Okay, so you guys, the website was called How to Recover Your Instagram Account Without Email or Phone Number. Follow Chain. So y'all, this helps, this website literally helped me out. Literally. It was my answer, y'all. So, you guys, it was about it was about the request report, y'all. This is what I did not know. These guys have been um, keeping have been um, following along. When I would do my my request support form in the let me see blah blah blah. So, you guys, this is the form that I have already felt I have already filled out or whatever it would not. This is the form I filled out. Now y'all, because of this e because of this this website right here, I understand what I was doing wrong. So you guys, because um I was for like for like the email you sign up with and the contact email if different, I was inputting my email, my Lava Guy email, in both of them. But I I realized that I wasn't really I was so Anxious to get my to get my account back. I wasn't really Paying attention so you guys it says the email you signed up with at the time at the time I should have been putting the Bitcoin cloud email address Because y'all this is what I'm gonna put the screenshot up because you know Yeah, I'm gonna put the screenshot up, you know, it says after you have tapped on I can't access this email or phone number. You will land on the request form. My bad. You will land on the request support form. The form allows you to contact Instagram support for help. Firstly, email. Wait, my. Firstly, enter the email address that you want Instagram to contact you with. Make sure that you have access to that email address. Next, enter the email address that is linked with your Instagram account. So you guys, with this phone right here, I'm gonna circle it and whatnot. Email you signed up with. That's when I put the Bitcoin email address and the contact email that they can contact me. That's when I put my Lava Guy email address. After I, so after I put the Bitcoin email address for the email you signed up with and my Lava Guy email for the contact email and I press the personal account with photos of me because my Lava Guy account it does have photos of yours truly and I press my account was hacked yes I pressed my account was hacked and then I described the details. I described in detail the whole I got hacked, the scammer, the email address, the phone number. I was putting everything in that add additional details 
box. So you guys, after that, you guys, I got an email from Instagram saying, so you guys, after I send the request form, this is the email that I get back from Instagram. You guys, it says, hi, thanks for verifying your identity. You're almost done getting back into your account. To gain access to your account, log out of any Instagram accounts you were where you were many where you may be logged in or on your computer, phone, or other device. Enter your username, LG, and password. Select the user recovery code from the menu and enter this eight digit security code to complete the login process. Please know that entering the eight digit code above will allow you to log in even if you're prompted for a six digit code. Y'all, when I say that helped me, that literally helped me out. Okay, so y'all, I go back into Instagram and I do the same thing. On, the only problem I was having at the time was that at first it wasn't working, but, but, let me see, I did not know what I was doing. And so after I got my, after I got the security code, I entered my... UL, my bad, I entered my Instagram username and the forgot password. When I was prompted, I don't know if I have to screenshot for this, but um, when I was prompted to enter, you know, a backup code or the two, my bad, or the eight digit code, you guys, I entered the eight, yes, after I, uh, y'all forgive me, I'm bouncing all over the place. When I was able to get into Instagram, I enter my my username, then forgot password, and for the two digit, I mean for the two uh, two step author two step authorization code, I was able to enter the eight digit security code, and then just like that, y'all, I was able to literally get back into my account. And y'all, as soon as I entered that, co that code in my account, and I went, once I was back into my account, I immediately, I changed the email address from Bitcoin back to my Lava Guy account. Like, literally, y'all. And then, y'all, not only did I change my, not only did I change my email address back to Lava Guy, back to my Lava Guy email address, I changed my password, I enabled the two-step authorization code, I screenshotted my backup codes and everything, okay? So you guys, moral of the story, because I know this video is going to literally be long as hell, and I'm going to have to go back and edit this and that, I don't know, y'all. But y'all, just know that if you guys, like one thing I'm going to tell y'all that if you guys get hacked out of your Instagram account for whatever reason, you guys, stay consistent. I'm out of here. Stay consistent. Stay consistent. Keep going. I don't care, y'all. If you got to, if it, it took me two to three days to get back into my account, y'all. And y'all, as soon as I got back into my account, I, I wish I would have, I wish I would have took a snapshot of my story, but you guys, I let all of my followers know that y'all, I got hacked in the last two days. Y'all, if y'all notice any kind of money in my account, don't believe it. It was a lie. I even said, go report this user. She hacked me and she scammed me. Y'all, all I'm saying is that if y'all take away anything from this video, y'all, please stay consistent. If you want to get your Instagram account back, your Instagram account back, stay consistent, keep at it, keep at it, keep at it, you guys. Like, I literally, I tried this, it was working, I tried that, it was working. It Like, it literally took me having to go through a whole goose, a whole goose chase, having to go from here to here to here to here just to find the solution that worked for me, okay? So, you guys, so what helped me was the website, I'm going to put everything in the description down below, I'm going to put the screenshot up or whatever it would not. But, y'all, stay consistent, okay? 
but yeah, I guess that's the end of this video. And y'all, I want I want y'all to know that it's not your fault for trying. It's not your fault for having high hopes. You know, I did lose some money. I did. I got hacked. But hey, when I got hacked, I rose back up. And you know what? That's that's what I really do like about being human, you guys. The fact that we are allowed to make a mistake and to come back from it, you know? That we, I refuse to let something like this keep me down and to keep me from prospering. I refuse to let this situation keep me from going out into the world and being happy, being excited, being me, you know? So one thing I would say, stay consistent. It's okay for you to make a mistake. If you fall, it gives you a reason to rise back up. If you fall, get, get your ass back up and try again. Well, don't try the situation again. You know, you, you don't want to get hacked again. But if you fall short, rise back up. That's all I got to say. You wish you boy Lava Guy. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and love your boy Lava Guy. See you next time.